So uh, one of the things that's drawn me to this field of uh, study of underwater fish sounds is that so little is known. Um, uh, there's only about a thousand fish sounds, different species that have been recorded worldwide, and that's a drop in the bucket. So uh, one of the things that I, people ask me, why do I do this? Why do I go out? And to me, quite honestly, it's the thrill of scientific discovery. So you go out, many times I'm in a different habitat sampling. I'm the first person that's ever heard those sounds before, and certainly the first person that's ever documented them. So, uh, for example, the, the fish farts in Maine, no one's ever heard any of that kind of stuff before. Um, so that's really interesting. And I was had the opportunity to go to the Amazon a few years ago, and I got to record all kinds of um, fish sounds, piranha sounds, things like that. It was just absolutely thrilling experience. So, to me, the big drive is is like like um, Captain Kirk on Enterprise. It's the thrill of discovery. So everywhere I go, it's like one of the <clears throat> early works we did, a uh, student of mine, Katie Anderson, um, she went out to New York City on the docks of New York City uh, and recorded uh, sounds. And many of those sounds to this day, we don't know what they are. And that to me is just, just so amazing that what you could argue as being the heart of the industrial world the scientific frontier is right there. It's not way out on the Galapagos Islands, it's not in the Amazon, it's not, of course those are frontiers, but right in your backyard is a whole world that we know almost nothing about. It's just, to me, that's what really gets me going.